It's a lesson about money and budgets for kids from a kid. A young entrepreneur will soon be on the road teaching financial school skills rather at schools and clubs all over Metro Atlanta. Cheryl Prehine talked to him about his latest venture. I love wrestling. For everything that makes Caden Harris like many 11 year olds. I have my Xbox. There's a long list of what sets him apart. This is my command center. He's a CEO, entrepreneur, and author. His latest idea. He said, listen, Dad, I have an idea. I would like to buy a bus and convert it into a mobile financial learning center. I want to be able to take it anywhere so that kids all over can learn about financial literacy. In his safe, he keeps the fortune cookie that confirmed it. Something on four wheels will soon be a fun investment for you. What yes. are the odds of that? Two weeks after that, he actually purchased the bus cash on his own with the profits from his business. Then it was time to renovate. The interior was trashed out. The bus just got done and it's hidden behind the new Black Wall Street and Stonecrest until the big reveal. Even Caden hasn't seen it yet. He wants to be surprised. Here is the finished product of the bus. Oh my God. His dad, here. Sean, gave us a first look. Uh, we're gonna have the ATM machine right here. There is an interactive bank and stock market. <laughs> Opening oh market. And a stocked store. So kids can be able to budget, figure out if they have necessities or just luxury items. Check out this floor. That is incredible. When Katie comes on this bus, he's going to lose his mind. But it's all about helping others. Once they learn economics at an early age, they can make lifelong, powerful decisions that can start building generational wealth. Empowering kids all over the state. We'll be able to have better communities, better cities, and I feel like this could really help. Cheryl Preheim, 11 Alive News. Now, Caden already has school visits on his schedule for next month. I mean, he's booked and busy. Yes, That's like is. my favorite story of the day. So earlier this year, he was at the state capitol talking about a bill requiring all students in Georgia to take financial classes before graduating high school. Way to go, young man.